Played it up the wall, back inside of West Corner territory. Here's Curley back in front. Oh, what a stop! Angelo Zoll gets across to the blocker's side and makes a tremendous save as that puck comes back to the blue line, forced just wide. What a stop that was by Zoll on Luke Urig right in front. Zoll back behind his net with it now. Tried to wheel it around left wing corner. It's picked off by Fraser to the blue line now. Cameron knocked it down. Left circle, Fraser to the net. He scores! Austin Fraser from the top of the left circle on heavy traffic in front of Angelo Zoll. 9-0-1 to go in this opening period. Fraser looked like he had the marker. Looks like Luke Urig tipped it in, and it's a 1-0 Prince George lead. Forced away from the front of the goal, back to the blue line. Isaiah Norlin, a long shot through traffic that was worked off the stick of Ben LaFranc to the corner. Down below the goal line now, it's Caron centering a pass in front. Devlin with a shot that stopped. Norlin scores! <laughs> we are certainly not able to say. Here's Bobby May off the board's right side. Now for Devlin, carrying it across the line, working wide. Devlin on the goal line, cuts to the net. He scores! Turning it back, left wing circle now from Oriello. Tried to push it to the blue line that was knocked down. Puck is still in Warrior possession. Fosco right side. Norland to the middle. Here's McDonald rolling up top. A long shot. Scores! <laughs> McDonald left it there. Van Hukachero comes out left wing circle. Still with it now to the left point. Left it along. Now Fosco left circle in. Scores! Seems like some of the players, they just have a streak. Like Jaden, oh, here we go. Giveaway for Norland of the blue line. Here's Evan Fidel. He's in a lone Lusiak tracking back, but Fidel scores as he beats Zoll on the blocker's side. And Evan Fidel's got his third goal of the season. And L Prince George makes it a 4-2 game with 3.15 to go in the second period. Chris Duclair battling there with Kai Greaves as it comes up the right side. Schneider carrying back and across the blue line. Left with circle feed. Luca Primarano scores. Left wing circle, Primarano put a shot on. I don't know if it deflected off a stick or what from the left circle, but it dribbled past the glove side of Angelo Zoll, and Primarano has a power play marker that makes it a 4-3 game. Five seconds to go in the power play. Brooks left side, Lusiak left circle, tried to put it to the net, that was knocked down. Lusiak back along for, for Devlin, put it to Brooks for a shot stop, rebound, scores! It's Felix Caron in front who puts it in. A power play goal with 3.58 to go in the third. The Warriors push their lead to two. It's 5-3. Uh, that's good to see. That's good to see. But that was a that was a lot of great possession by the Warriors in the offensive zone. It was uh, They basically had the entire power play there uh, possessing the puck in this Bruce King zone. Picking over the goal. Back along right wing side. Taken over here by Nelson. High slot, Nelson a shot, stopped by Fenema, rebound in front, scores! Before the end of this game with 8.8 .8 to go here in the third, the Warriors lead by three, face off one ahead by Jake Bernadette, inside of the offensive zone, Kylas Green in the left wing corner, making a move below the goal line, chipped it off the side of the net, that will sound the buzzer, and this one's over, the Warriors win! Six to three, the final score. West Kelowna comes away with the victory. Big nights for the NHL draft picks of the Warriors tonight. Luke Devlin of the Pittsburgh Penguins has a goal and two assists tonight. Ben McDonald of the Seattle Crack and a goal and two assists. The Warriors get multi-point efforts from uh, quite a few players on this night. Angelo Zoll turning aside 19 of the 22 shots. He faces in the game and West Kelowna back in the win column, 6-3 the final score. The Warriors defeat the Prince George Spruce Kings here tonight.